Hello, everyone. It is Tuesday, July the 2nd, 2019. And welcome to your Tech Tuesday tip with Robert Mac Williams. Uh, we want to uh, offer technology tips that you can use today. Um, so, uh, don't know if you've seen this on your college campus, we're showing here. Uh, we have a group of students uh, buried in their mobile devices. We got a tablet, a phone, do have also a laptop or whatnot. And, um, and in most cases, um, these students are watching video. As a matter of fact, you may be on a mobile device right now watching this video um just like these students are so needless to say in today's time in 2019 video is vital whether it's from an entertainment perspective um or in the industry that we're in from an educational perspective if you are teaching you should be incorporating video if you are teaching, you should even be creating your own video. Um, video is definitely vital in today's time. Um, I was watching a webinar last week by Steve Rosales, um, Six Ways Every Learning Leader Should Be Using Video. Um, one is to preserve the knowledge of exiting employees two is employee onboarding um for training new employees or adjuncts or instructors um three uh for social learning of course probably one of the biggest things out there is youtube and and, and even ted talks uh and other type things for increasing social learning via video um also number four for mobile learning as our beginning picture students are utilizing mobile devices now more than even traditional desktop machines uh, five for executive messaging uh, this is demonstrated even in in our system from acca from uh even uh even when our president came on board it was broadcast through an executive messaging a message um and six from for for most of our applications were recording instructor led training now i want to show give you some free tools um that you can use to start incorporating video uh in your uh workflow um many of you are probably familiar with the software camtasia uh, which of course we do utilize here at our institution but uh, of course Camtasia does come uh, with a price tag uh, it is not free uh, it is um, should be licensed and um, so I'm gonna give you a few tools that you can use for free uh, to create video so cam studio is one that I've been using for for many years um, very similar to Camtasia. Uh, it gives you the ability to record all screen and audio activity on your computer. It allows you to output that video as AVI and streaming flash videos. Um, this is uh, available for Windows machines. Um, and in essence, to, to obtain this, in essence, you just go to camstudio.org and it is a free download ice cream apps this was one i just discovered um just at a conference uh, back in may uh and it has as you can see uh quite a few uh, free thing tools that you can uh utilize um but for our purposes here the screen recorder uh basically it, it is web-based so in essence you just go to icecreamapps.com uh, it works on Mac and uh, Windows machines, and of course, um, you can just click go to the site and it uh, activate that on your machine. Um, again, there's other tools that are available for free that you can definitely feel free to explore those. Screencast-O-Matic. Uh, 
that's actually how I'm creating this video right now. Uh, works on Windows, Mac, and Chromebook. Uh, so you have three options that you can utilize uh, this this uh, tool on. Um, also, for those who utilize Canvas, which we do here at our institution, uh, there's a Screencast-O-Matic plugin. Now, uh, Screencast-O-Matic is free. Um, if you uh, desire some more editing capabilities, there is an upgrade that you can take advantage of if you so desire. But um, you can record up to 15 minutes of footage free. Uh, and from that point, once you uh, record it, you can download it and, of course, place it in your LMS or upload it or dis uh, distribute it however to your liking. Uh, lastly, um, Jing, this one's kind of been around for a while. Uh, it's, it's just kind of, I figured I would throw it out there. It's um, actually made by the same company that makes Camtasia. Uh, it soon will be unsupported, um, as I noted on the website today. But uh, um, there's another program called Snagit that's very similar to this. Of course, Snagit does have a fee. But uh, if you don't like the other three tools, you can definitely um, also play with Jing. Go into techsmith.com slash jing dash tool dot html. Uh, and in essence, you can um, utilize this tool to record video. So I highly encourage you all to incorporate video in your instruction and in your daily uh, or, or at least in your, your workflow um, to some degree. Uh, again, this is Robert Mac Williams. Feel free to reach out to me if you have any questions uh, on these uh, tools or if you have any comments or any ideas or anything that you want me to cover in the near future on the next upcoming Tech Tuesday. Thank you for watching.